today's a bag lady and it's five past nine um it's the 16th of may 2019 uh we've just done school run me and my hubby nipped ruby so we're back we've already done school run and it's literally five past nine so we've got the whole day ahead of us um and i don't know what to do well i do i've got loads of things i need to do so i need to have my breakfast and i want to carry on with a bit more of my garden because i think it's going to rain at the weekend poor people that work all week and then you think oh it was gonna be really nice at the weekend and then it rains it's just horrible the weather's so rude why can't people that work in the week they want a bit of sunshine at the weekend bless them anyway my dear so we need to get breakfast and then do some tidying up and then see what the day brings there's my breakfast so we've got a big bowl of fruit lots of yogurt low fat yogurt and then a nice cup of tea that's my third cup of tea of the day so i must be on a tea mission today right breakfast all eaten first time of the day bit of washing up so we better crack on do not want to waste my day today my two little hens are sat there waiting still haven't found them a new home bless them they're very cute <laughs> I'm still cleaning up. Why does every room get such a mess? Like all the beds want making. There's clothes everywhere. It's hard work I'm trying to keep everywhere tidy. It's hard work watching somebody else run around working. Where's you out just thinking about it? Right, I've had instructions from my hubby. We've got to feed the birds because he forgot to do it. So let's get sprinkling. I've been putting some little bits on my Depop shop. So I've just put this little clown on. He is so cute. I don't know if you can see this, but he's so lovely. Look at his little stones. And his little arms and legs move. And I've got international postage on because obviously he's not heavy. So we could send him abroad. So if you're overseas, you can have one. He's so lovely. And I think I'm going to put this little bag on as well. If I get a chance. Um, it's so cute. It's like a little clutch bag. Um, with like a lovely long gold chain it's so nice I really like this bag keep debating about keeping it myself it's so lovely but if not it'll be going on my little depop shop and my shop's name is pink car 07 so I'll have to see if I can find anything else to put on there does anybody else do this when the weather's nice you start looking for things to wash because <laughs> you know that you can actually get it dry outside so I've washed all my beds this week um, I've done all my washing now I'm looking for things that I don't normally wash so I've just found James's coat needs a good wash so I've chucked that in the washing machine because it's lovely when you know that you can get your washing outside and it dries yeah it's 11 o'clock which if we're at home could only mean one thing the kettle is on yay so as you might well guess look at the day I'm going to use this mug for the eating cake so I am absolutely starving today and I would definitely rather be eating cake. So anyway, let's just look a nice cup of coffee. Finally go outside and do a little bit more gardening. I don't think it's quite as warm today, but it's still nice. So let's go outside. The birds are still singing. So I've been very busy the last couple of days. I've been cutting my edges around my garden. You can see this. I think it looks really nice. I've given it like a neat little edge in front of the stones and stuff, but I've only gone so far, so I've got to carry on. And it's really hard work. You can kind of see where I've got to look. And then my husband did a bit over here, so there's just this bit here needs to be made wider. It's a nightmare. It's so hard to cut it. It's a hard life being an old cat, isn't it? <laughs> oh, right, well, we've got so far along. We've still got a bit of a way to go.
inside for my dinner. So for today's dinner we've got seafood sticks, little posh orange tomatoes and mackerel in sunflower oil, which you shouldn't really have sunflower oil, it's bad for you, but it was the last tin in the cupboard, so off to enjoy it. Right, I was going to nip out, but I'm trying to resist the urge to go out all the time, so I think we need to just carry on pottering in the garden, because I want to make my garden really, really nice, so um, I'm just trying to think of some things that I can do in it, so my brain, excuse me, my brain's going round and round. Oh, I'm moving pots round, I'm trying to see what my garage wall will look like with nothing on it. Um, I'm going to get rid of the picture, I think, and then maybe get some more tall pots like that, and then paint maybe my garage door and my gate. Oh, I've been trying to get that bloody picture down off the garage wall. I've been using wrenches, nut things, all sorts. So I've managed to undo all the screws, and then I put the bench there ready to catch it if it fell, and then my hubby rang me up and said, I'm coming home for a coffee. So I was like, oh, you've just saved me from dropping that really heavy picture on me. So I'm waiting for him to get back now so we can lift it down. Look at my poor old hands. They're all like red and sore. All my knuckles are sore. I've got all like blisters coming where I've been like gardening and stuff. My poor hands. Oh dear. Right, so we'll just wait for my hubby and then we'll get that picture down off the wall. Still waiting. I don't think it's far away, so we should be here soon. So I'm just listening to the birds. And the wind. It's down at long last. So I'm having a good clear out of stuff I need and I don't need. <laughs> Back inside. We've literally got 10 minutes, so we've got to fetch Ruby from school. So it's like, you can't get stuck into anything. Ugh, I hate bloody school run. <laughs> and that's just be, me being moany. Don't you just love it when you're a bit hot, so you swap your top? And then you get left with like marks on your arms where your top's been. <laughs> Oh dear. Anyway, so bag of the day. Um, obviously, we've not really been anywhere, but bag of the day has been my Morby Bay's water, which I did use yesterday as well. Love this bag so much. They're so light compared to the old ones. And I have owned this for probably about two and a half years now. So it's, I've had it quite a long time. Um, and it's still really lovely. I'll have to do a little review on it now it's getting on a bit, bless it. We're ready to go to school run. I stepped out the door and then decided it was a bit cold and I needed something on my arm. So I put this cool little jacket on that I got the other day from the second hand shop. Apparently big puffy sleeves are in fashion at the moment. And this has got major puffy sleeves. I'm probably a bit overdressed for school run. But um, oh well, it's a bit of fun isn't it. So I'm rocking my puffy sleeves. In the car, so off we go. Off to go and get little Ruby. And you have to leave like half an hour earlier so that you get a space. Off we go. We've arrived. We've now got to sit here for about 17 minutes, which will feel like about 17 hours. <laughs> Eight minutes left, and it feels like we have been sat here for like hours. It's horrible. I hate waiting. It's so boring. Especially when you don't talk to me. Got to love a bit of score and chaos. I'm so glad that I'm not driving. Oh dear. Trailer on this boat. Yep. Oh dear. Is it going to fit past it? Probably not. Yeah. Oh dear. I oh, know he's going up the grass. <laughs> God. Wow. I'm so glad I'm not driving. It's horrible. The road wasn't made for three. Now we're stuck again. We got through one bit and now we're stuck again. Near a yellow bus. It's all fun and games. Oh dear, poor bus driver. Oh dear. Wow, chaos. We 
we've made it one way. Now we've got to, we've got to turn around and come back. So we're hoping that we might get through, but it's not looking good. And we're still moving. One finger, one thumb, keep moving. One finger, one thumb, keep moving. I'm so glad that I am not driving. It's so nice to actually show somebody how awful it is. Oh, we've made it! We've made it through! Yay! Now I can actually get home. So we've made it home after tonight's tea. I'm cheating. We've got Slimming World chicken Mediterranean vegetable pasta. So it's in the microwave. I'm just waiting for it to ping. Right, there's my little tea. It doesn't look overly exciting, but they do taste really nice. So I've just kept it in its tray so the juice doesn't go all over my plate. So I'll have to enjoy my little Slimming World tea. That's my tea all eaten. And as if by magic, the washing up bowl has filled itself up again. So more washing up. Wow, a bit of an amazing sunset tonight, my dears. I don't know if I can try and zoom in a bit, but look at the colour of the sky. Hello. Hello. Wow, look at that. Red sky at night, shepherd's delight. Lovely. Right, my dears. I've just washed all my hair. I've been faffing around trying to curl it with a pair of straightening irons. Um, I've never done that before. I always curl my hair with curling tongs, so it was quite a weird uh, thing for me, but I thought, oh, I'll just give it a go. So I've been copying like YouTube things, and I've kind of got the knack of it. My hair's still a little bit damp, though. I think my hair wasn't dry enough to do it, but I'll have another go again tomorrow. Anyway, my dear, so I'm going to love you and leave you. So thank you very much for joining me today. I think it's probably been a bit boring, a bit normal, but we can't go out every day. <laughs> so it is, if you do enjoy life in England, daily vlogs, handbags, shopping, and whatever else we get up to then please subscribe to my channel and come and find me on instagram as mrs crazy bag lady and my little depop shop my name is pink car 07 so i love you olivia and i'll speak to you tomorrow bye